Good day. Welcome to Revit Tutorial 2023 from Martinez Design. So we we'll continue with our project, which is Hotel Design Tutorial, and where we are explaining how to design a project, particularly from foundation to finish. So a lot of people have asked questions about, okay, can they do this? Can they do this? It is more possible. To so kindly subscribe to our channel and you will be getting updates as we progress in this particular project. So what we do is that we want to create a foundation at the same time create multi-level story for this building to come to reality. So we have told you before that this particular building has a lot of things attached to it. So that's what we want to start with. So how do you create a foundation? Go to foundation and see what is there. You see that display, no any drawing, no any nothing. So what you do is that you come here and you select wall. When you select your wall, you just select all instances in this facility, feasibility. So as we have seen it select in this view. So you go to your foundation, and you click on foundation. What you do is to go to modify. For modify, okay, something is strong. As you click here, click again, select all instance in this project, in this view, then you click on clipboard, copy this button, click all these things you have selected, copy them to clipboard, and you go to your foundation, at the foundation what you do is that you need to paste them here, and if you paste them there, there is still going to be some certain conflict, you are going to see the noise that will come out of it, so click here, and say paste to align level. You can click on place on align level to see more of the level. So what we want to do is only one level we want to use, which is what foundation for now. So you just click on it, say paste on foundation. So you see make noise because of what some of these highlight work overlaps. So how do you adjust it? It's what we want to talk about here. So you just go to your top constraint level and you say you can attach it to foundation if you want. Or you change this to something that's okay more lesser that's what i will do since i know my the height of my foundation i will just use like okay i want to use 800 giving the space for slab as well so if you add slab of 200 with the 800 of 800 height of wall of the foundation wall it will definitely amount to 1000 so i just want to look around and say apply so everything has been applied so if you look at it from your elevation Can you see? So this is our this is what we just created. So the these are the doors. I'm going to delete them one after the others. So what you do now is that you go to your foundation back. I mean level one and go to foundation. As you are in foundation, you just click on this and say select all instances in this view. And you do what to delete them all everything will be deleted so whatsoever that is assembled that will be deleted so you can see them again from your view and you see that those things are no more applicable so it's only there in a level one so you can when you check anywhere you check in your project you are going to see that you have created that one so now the next thing to do is that you want to create multi-level story so in multi level story we allow you to have enough uh, uh, levels so you can be creating levels one after the other by saying create and click on create similar you get what i'm saying you can say create similar then at the level of 3000 you draw one so that is level four for you so you can now you name it to level three so that stop confusing you so that the next one you are going to create is going to follow you are not going to start okay so from there when you double click just press three so this will automatically change so the next level you are going to create when you say create similar you just have to do what understand the height from the beginning to three thousand as well or you can use more depends on the standard regulation of your country so you create that and put it here. What you do is say none of these are what 
completed are visible. The reason why it's not visible is that the crop, the few, the soil crop region are what are hidden. So you click on the crop region and you expand it. As you see, so you can click on that crop region and expand as much as possible, so that that will give you a total width. So you see, so you do more and you do what you extend it. This one you have no dimension that you say you can follow. So extend this particular one this way. Here is the technicality of creating. You need to continue watching this video to the end. And if you are new here, only try to subscribe and much more. So now, as you are creating this level, this level starts appearing here. If you want to see how we create most level using Nari, yeah, you there is tutorial we have done. On, on our playlist, check it there and work on it. So, a lot of tutorials have been done. You can always check for what you need. And if there's anything that you know that you don't have, you can make a special request for us. We do it up of precise. It's, that is what we do. So, every day we bring, can you see, the more you do the level, the more you have it. So, I just want to have something like, are you seeing that the, the level are now following and numbered after one another? So that is how you have your levels in place. So all this one that you have done are majorly done by what? By creating a certain pattern that suit the delivery system of time. So that is what you do. So you can do what? You can minimize this by clicking on, on that one. Because we are not going to work with ceiling for now. We are still going to use it later, but not for now. So level one, level two, you can decide to rename your level the way you want them to be seen. It does not matter whatsoever you do. So that is how you do. So now I want to create, want to repeat this before we now decide to demarcate them. We have already through with the shape that we want to use at the level two. We want to maintain this shape to some certain level before we start twisting this shape for ourselves. So click on this and say select all distance in this view. Then you click on keyboard, say select copy, copy to clipboard. Then from there, you can decide to place from level level three, four, five, six, seven. I will leave eight for something else. So I want to click on from level three to level seven. So I will click and we just say paste to align to selected level. So, I'm not using foundation level, I've done that. So, you click on from level 3 and you press shift on your keyboard and press 7. So, it realize that four and uh, five level that you want to create on. So, what you do is that you just click on it and say text OK. It's loading everything into those. So, or some things is there, it's telling you that some words are overlapping, which is true. So you go to your validation and go and see what you have done. So the validation I've told you before, the region, the crop region of this one is the one that has been top of toggle the uh, crop region and expand it so that it will give you a fitting. And if you don't want that, you finish here because like you are editing it. You can decide to say, okay, you don't want the crop view, let them be disappeared. So you don't want them, so they will disappear and you are able to see the design you are doing, this particular hotel. So you walk in that line and see what you have created. So if you go to foundations, level two, everything will repeat itself. So before you can now start to do editing of this one. So. The editing is going to happen, we are going to do everything one after the other on this one. But we want to get the shape and form right. That is why we have created this particular one. So if you want to see it in your 3D, the default 3D, you can click on 3D default here and see what you have created. This is it for now. So that is how that is what you have done. And this is how you create a multi-level project by yourself. So we want to work in partitions in your piece 
in our next tutorial so follow us one after the other we don't want to keep you born so that's why we are doing this one so this is going to be a massive project